Okay, I won't. I'm sorry. I will be good boy from now on, I swear. I don't think this is gonna be any better than what happened a minute ago. It's too much shake! Ring the bell, everybody! Ring the bell! Ring the dying bell! Because it's finally here! The Five Nights at Freddy's Core Collection! Doesn't it look beautiful? So the memories we've all been waiting for, everybody. The Five Nights at Freddy's games, but physical, all in one, in a big collection. I can't believe it. What, what? It's finally here. So yeah, we're gonna unbox this and at the same time, check it out gameplay-wise and see what it just looks like. Will it have some kind of hub where we choose each game when we start up? Will there be extras? Will there be other stuff? I don't really know, so let's find out together here. So, yep, here it is. Of course, I have the Nintendo Switch Edition. Graphically, it's going to look all the same on all the other consoles on more powerful hardware. So, why not have it portably and on a big screen at the same time? Big brain. So, let's get this garbage plastic wrap off and find out all the details on the box. Also, there seems to be some kind of new render of Freddy here, which looks rather absolutely fantastic. So on the front, it says, Five Nights at Freddy's. And then randomly at the top, it then says, Core Collection includes Five Nights at Freddy's one to four plus sister location. So I already knew when this got announced that it would only include FNAF one, two, three, four and sister location, a very bizarre decision. <laughs> Where is Pizzeria Similar? You can somewhat understand Ultimate Custom Night, but even then... Why not include them? It is honestly very, very strange, but let's look at the back here. The core collection includes the first five games that started it all. Five Nights at Freddy's, Five Nights at Freddy's 2, Five Nights at Freddy's 3, Five Nights at Freddy's 4, and Five Nights at Freddy's uh, Sister Location! Interestingly enough, on the back it seems like maybe a new render of Baby there and maybe a new render of Funtime Freddy. It kind of looks like the Funtime Freddy from the trailer? I'm not entirely sure, but again, renders that I have hardly seen anyway. If you guys have seen them somewhere else in some kind of other merch or in the games, let me know in the comment section down below. But these are new to my eyeballs. We have screenshots of FNAF 2, FNAF 4 and FNAF 3 because that's the order we got the games. We got FNAF 2 first, then we went straight to 4, and then we went to 3. That, that's, that's the order. Yep, that's the way Scott released them for some bizarre reason. But below the images it says, Meet Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, and more. Keep a close eye on your surroundings. Can you survive the night? <laughs> I love how it just questions you at the end. Can you survive the day? <laughs> Let's actually open up this bad boy. Will we get a manual? Will we get a secret thank you message from Scott himself? Will we get something more than you usually get opening up Switch games? Let's find out because this is the first time all of the original FNAF games, all of the original FNAF games, all of the original FNAF games, all of the original FNAF games. Here we go, guys. The moment, the truth. It's too much shake. It's actually shake. It's flippant, guys! <laughs> it's really basic, there's nothing in there, there's just some corporate text and there's the cartridge. It's it's pretty lame to be honest. <laughs> so I said this before about our Help Wanted Physical Edition unboxing review video, that because FNAF has finally gone physical after so long, and it kind of is quite an achievement, it's quite the milestone, you know, it's something you should be proud of. I thought Scott would be all giddy about this, but no, we don't get no special editions. We don't get that treatment. Undertale did it better. We just get basic standard physical cases with just the cartridge. No extra figures, no extra merch on the side. No nice big box with stuff in. We just get... This is what being a FNAF fan is all about, apparently. Okay, maybe I'm exaggerating a little, but guys, it would have been cool if we just got a little more, again, a special edition, something on those lines, because it is a milestone. It is an achievement, but let's look at the cartridge here. And dang! It's just about what I expected. <laughs> well, it's time to put this in the old switch, Rooney, And see how it plays. The game card could not be read. <laughs> Please remove and reinsert it. The first impressions are glorious. <laughs> Wait. Wait, what's going on? Now it's working. But it has the physical cartridge logo over the games I already had downloaded on here. It's not a separate game. 
You put it in and it just boots up all the games separately. No extra special thing. You don't boot it up and then choose a game in a menu. Nothing like that. So I actually put in my girlfriend's Switch here and I want to see this for real because again, I already had all the games downloaded digitally on my Switch, but my girlfriend, she doesn't have any FNAF game on here. So I want to see truly what happens if you don't have them downloaded digitally and you just put in the cartridge. So let's, let's see what happens here. I don't think this is going to be any better than what happened a minute ago. Oh, that is what happens. I was... I was secretly hoping that's not what would happen. I thought it would be some weird conundrum with my Switch because I had them digitally. But it just boots up all the games individually like you had him, uh, like you had them digitally and separate. That is, that's bad. I expected some kind of at least uh, game that you would boot up and again that you would select the titles from there. And then maybe like they would describe the games a little bit like have a little blurb each tell you really basically what the game would be about that's really bad let's just boot up the first for now see what happens i heard this game had cheats as well but oh well there is cheats at least on the first for now okay this is just like the nintendo switch digital download version anyway unlimited power fast nights so that's all the same new game Help wanted! We need someone to make a way better version of the FNAF Core Collection. <laughs> and there it is, FNAF. That's right. fnaf -le. With the cheats. That's good. FNAF 2! Guys, if you want to see me play these properly, we did a video going some time back when they all initially came out. Digitally. I'll leave that link in the description down below, card somewhere on the screen. We've also checked out Sister Location Pizzeria Similar as they came out separately uh, past the initial four that did. All right, this is all normal and good. So the games just play as you would expect. They're all normal, they boot up fine, but what I'm disappointed about is what I already said. I thought we'd have this collection to boot up and then we choose the titles on this menu and we get some blurbs, maybe some extra information like something like that something on the level of like mario all stars that recently came out just something similar to that that's what i thought would happen not that the games would just in individually be on your switch home screen like that looks so bad i don't know so we got the we got the cheats for fnaf 2 it's basically the same thing new game Help wanted. We still need someone to make a better FNAF core collection that includes Pizzeria Simulator, Ultimate Custom Night, has extras, has details about the games, tells us when they were made. It's FNAF 2, all right. And uh, admittedly, I still love it. I can't say anything bad about it. FNAF 2, man. One of my favorites. Yep, the radar cam, that's cool. So you got all your cheats. FNAF 3. Okay, FNAF 3, no cheats. None. I would suspect there's cheats when you actually complete the game. Although I think the cheats should have been just when you start, like with FNAF 1 and 2, as we saw with them. Yeah. So that's lame. Coming soon. A better collection of the FNAF core collection. <laughs> well, FNAF 3, by the way. It's FNAF 3. Hey, hey, glad you came back for another night. I promise. You said that to me a thousand times, and has it ever been more interesting? No, Sister Location. There's no doubting what you've achieved on a Sister level. Location. These are clearly state of the art. There are the, just. I feel like I've missed the game. Come on, this cutscene is still cool. She this cutscene was hype. It was hype. Look at baby die. We were it feels like my birthday. So here we have the extras custom night. Why aren't they just unlocked from the get-go, you know? Like, why not? We got the core collection for an overpriced £30. Yeah, that's how much it cost. I think that's a fair bit more than getting all the games individually. Daddy, why won't you let me play with her? Because she's a murderous genocidal robot that's gonna suckle you up. Welcome well, to the first sister day of your location. exciting new career. 
Whether you were approached at a jump, it still looks good. Our ad and screws it both. still looks good. I we like it. You. I like it a lot. And it's interesting because joystick moves cursor by the way. Robotics and unit Isn't that weird? Oh, yeah, we forgot about you. Well, you can adjust the aspect ratio. That's interesting. You can have it back in the day, or you can have it now. Back in the day, or now. Back in the day now, 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 back in the day now. Five days until the part. Hello, Freddy Faz Golden Poopy. What did he do this time? He locked you in your RAM again. Don't be scared. I I'll hurt with y'all. Aw, oh, that's very kind. I love you, Freddy Fredbear. You're my possessed Fredbear that I love oh so much. I like how your eyeballs just follow me wherever I go. That totally doesn't add to my nightmares that I'm already having. Nope. Let me out, you bad man. I will call police and tell them you are abusive. I will... Okay, I won't. I'm sorry. I will be good boy from now on, I swear. Wow. FNAF 4. FNAF 4. What? FNAF 4. What? It is FNAF 4. I can't... What? What? I can't believe it. It's scarier than the other games. <laughs> and I still wet myself to this day. What? Did I just tell you the truth? Marisu exposed. He still wets the bed at night when he plays this game. Seriously, this is one of the scariest ones out of the lot. It's flipping terrifying. Well, there you have it, guys. The Five Nights at Freddy's core collection. You know I'm disappointed. I thought at least, I keep saying it, there would be something you boot up. There would be some menu. You pick the games. Like, at least that, but... For a surprise, maybe some blurbs, some descriptions of the games when they were made. Like, just something! But no, you put the cartridge in, and you get all the games just like you had them digitally. You might as well just have them digitally, because I'm pretty sure FNAF 1, 4, and Sis 1, 2, 3, 4, and Sister Location is less than the £30 I spent on this disappointment. If you're a collector, if you're a big fan of FNAF, and you like your stuff physically like I do, this is still good in that sense, but if you're content with having it digitally, Having it most likely cheaper, like I said, probably way cheaper than getting the physical edition, just download, downloading FNAF 1, 2, 3, 4, and just location digitally by themselves, uh, then go for that, you know? I mean, they don't take that much memory, even on the Switch, it's hardly anything for the initial Switch storage. And this is also on Xbox, PS4, and they also have all the games, I'm pretty sure now, digitally, including Pizzeria Simulator, which isn't here, so that's... I never... I just expected a little bit more, but guys, we're gonna get out of here. What do you think about this Fun It's Freddy's Core Collection? Do you own it? Do you have it on PS4? Do you have it on Xbox? What are they like on there? On there? Are they magically better? Do they magically not just boot them up on your screen separately? Do they actually have its own game where you you select them from and it has blurbs and all the good stuff and extras that I wanted? That, that's, that's a pipe dream. That... Apparently that's that's a pipe dream. <laughs>